Pitchers and catchers have already reported for Brave Spring training the last few days. But today offered a glimpse at a few all-star batters on the team, including the reigning MVP. Fox High's Miles Garrett has more from Florida. The first few days of spring training is always dedicated to pitchers and catchers. But on day three, there was a new sound echoing through Cool Today Park. The reigning MVP was back to obliterating baseballs. For me, the way I look at it is that MVP stays in 2023, so now I just gotta move forward and um, continue to try to just accomplish what I can on the field and have a continue to work hard and you know contribute on the field with the guys and hopefully more success down the road. Yet gave time for a reflection on how last season ended. I played terribly, it's not a secret. Um, but it's a new year, it's a new season, so just continue to work, continue to focus, and take this new opportunity to just go further and do better this season. A 40-70 season might be difficult to encore, but Acuna says there's no limits to maybe exceeding that this year. Is a 50-50-60-60 season out of the question? No, no. Yeah, I think, you know, anything's possible. Like I said, I'm not going to complain that I'm going to go on 50-50 or 60 season, half season or anything like that, but hopefully if I can stay healthy, you know, and like I said, anything's possible. You, you can't set any limitations on him. Um, I wouldn't be shocked by anything that he did, honestly, but um, no, it's not like we're, we're expecting some uh, major thing. Um, it's it's going to be a great season regardless of what he does. Um, he's one of the best players in the game, so uh, I'll sit back and watch. And those expectations will most likely continue into the future as well. When asked about his own career trajectory, Ronald Acuna Jr. simply said, it's no secret, I want to be a Brave for life. At Brave Spring Training in Northport, Miles Garrett, Fox 5 Sports.